Welcome, and we're getting a late start today. I've had a very busy patient day and business meeting day, but better late than never, and this is um, perfect timing for this type of video. It's going to be the Yoga Collection, doTERRA's Yoga Collection, one of my favorite doTERRA oil blends, all in one collection kit, and yoga stretching. So we're going to end it with some nice calming, relaxing stretching at the end. So it's a perfect way to um, introduce all of this at the end of the day. And you can also practice this in the morning. So I'm Dr. Michelle, doctor of acupuncture, Chinese medicine, registered nurse background. And I welcome you here for some yoga and yoga blends. I'm going to go through the yoga collection and introduce those to you. I am a fan of yoga. I love doing yoga um, in my right here <laughs> in my favorite little sanctuary place so that's why I thought I'd film it here and then I also love doing yoga out in the sunshine out on um, if you go to my video on my YouTube channel it's my favorite place to be out on the beach bluffs um, I do a lot of yoga out there when it's warm and sunny so I encourage you all to check out yoga I actually do yoga prescribing in my medical practice. Um, there's protocols pretty much for everything that ails you. And this is actually one of the books I love to use when I'm prescribing for patients. I'll actually print certain yoga postures out here, out of this book, um, for specific um, conditions such as back pain, anxiety, insomnia, etc. So this is a really great book. And you can also come to me and I can um, personalize it for you as well. So um, consider adding yoga into your life to help balance your body, mind, and spirit. This is a really important time uh, for the year and also with the holidays coming upon us to keep balanced um, and stay serene and peaceful. So we're going to dive in to the yoga collection. And the Yoga Collection is an, a trio. It's going to be three blends. And I'm going to give you a close-up here. It comes in this really cute little package. So this makes a really great gift to, you know, somebody that loves yoga. I also like to use my oils out of the Yoga Collection when I meditate and also my prayer time. So, um, or even if I just want to create a certain mood in my day, um, I'll pull out one of these blends. And this box is really cute, too, because when you open it up, it's got a message. And it says, the body achieves what the mind believes, which is so true. And then it's got um, the beautiful trio of oils that we're going to go through tonight. So the first oil um, that we're going to go through is Anchor, and this is also known as the Steading Blend, such as Steady. Um, and this brings a firm trust in yourself so you can approach your practice and life with calming strength. And incorporate uh, this particular blend incorporates lavender, cedarwood, sandalwood, cinnamon, frankincense, black pepper, patchouli, and a base of fractionated coconut oil. This blend supports your connection to yourself and your innate wisdom. So I'm going to give you a little close-up. Now, all of these bottles in the yoga collection kit are 5 milliliter. So that's going to give you approximately 100 drops um, per bottle. So it will last you a while. Um, I actually have it diffusing in my diffuser right now. I tend to like to use at least five to eight drops just because uh, my sniffer isn't always the strongest. But if you're sensitive, you could maybe get away with just two to three drops of the um, essential oil blend. And then um, the yoga collection is going to be the CPTG essential oils, the certified pure therapeutic grade in all of the blends, and it's designed for the yogi in you. So um, 
There's three different blends. I just went through the anchor. There's also a line and a rise. And these blends are great to add to your life and your yoga practice. And like I said, also meditation, prayer time um, to just really get um, centered, steady, and enlighten your spirit through every breath while strengthening and stretching your body. So we'll be doing some of that later tonight. Um, primary benefits of the yoga collection support an effective yoga practice. So if you are a yoga practitioner, you could consider adding these into your yoga practice through your students. You could even, um, now that a lot of people are doing Zoom meetings, you could send them little samples uh, before the class so then everybody can experience diffusing and wearing them topically while they're practicing their yoga that you're teaching them. Um, also, if you're a yoga student, um, just be encouraged to order the whole kit so you can pick what one is calling to you for that moment. The anchor also promotes uh, feelings of completeness, calmness, and courage. So that's the one that we just went over, anchor. I really love this one. It's very grounding. And the next blend that we're going to do is the Align Blend. And the Align Blend is also known as the Centering Blend. So this one could be used any time of your life, any time of the day, depending again what's calling to you. So the um, Align Blend features bergamot in the uh, blend, coriander, marjoram, uh, peppermint, jasmine, rose, and it's also in a base of the fractionated coconut oil. So the fractionated coconut oil helps to absorb the oils systemically, and then it's also um, helps so the um, if you are sensitive to oils, even though these are the pure oils, it's going to help reduce sensitivity to um, any hot oils and more sensitive oils that might be in the blend. So that one is the Centering Blend Align, and then this one is um, a blend that helps you to trust in yourself and stay open to all possibilities, something we all need to do to create more opportunity in our lives. So again, the Align Blend um, is a wonderful one. And then the last blend that I'm going to share is called Arise. Oh, let me go back on um, the Align Blend. Just a couple little tidbits on the Align Blend is it encourages harmony and calm progress. So um, probably helps that sense of if you're feeling overwhelmed. <laughs> um, it just helps to bring back that center and align you. So the Arise Blend is the third and last blend that is in the Yoga Collection Kit. And this one is also known as the Enlightening Blend. This could be a really great one to use in the morning if you practice morning yoga um, because it has citrus oils in it. So it's going to be somewhat uplifting, uplifting the senses. It helps to instill feelings of happiness, clarity, and courage. And then let me go through what's in that particular blend. So the uh, Arise Enlightening Blend uh, has grapefruit, lemon, osmanthus, melissa, Siberian fir, and a base of fractionated coconut oil. Now it is recommended that um, you be careful if you are putting this on topically um, to reduce um, time out in the sun or if you are in the sun, cover the area where you put the oil because the citrus oil can be um, react with the UV rays. So um, the Arise Blend inspires moments of reaching for your highest potential. And it's going to help support stability as well as your freedom. So a really beautiful blend. And um, this makes the last out of the trio, the last blend. Now, you could also get really creative, and sometimes I've mixed and matched, depending on, well, if I want to arise, but I also want to stay grounded. Um, I may go ahead and use a few drops out of each bottle um, 
in my diffuser. And then um, these you're not going to want to ingest. And you'll know that because there's no supplement label on these. So that's how you know when you can ingest the oil. So these uh, are the two ways that you can use them is aromatically, which would be in your diffuser, humidifier, cotton ball, tissue. Uh, and then the second way is topical. So I always like to put my uh, blends on Oh, there's Lane. Hi, Lane. <laughs> um, I always like to put my um, mood blends, which I consider these mood blends because they're affecting you neurologically. They're grounding you and affecting your neurological state. I always like to make sure I'm putting the on the brain stem, up on the brain. And that's what I do with my patients, too, is I'll massage that right onto the brain and the brain stem area. And then for myself personally, I like to put them on my wrist points too. And that way I can take a whiff. And then it's nice to put them on your heart chakra as well, because that's a really great place of opening, getting centered in life over the heart chakra. You can also put it on your throat chakra. So um, help communication and just align and balance you. So again, uh, beautiful, beautiful collection kit, a great gift for somebody in your life um, that's a yogi or not a yogi, maybe a soon-to-be yogi, and also just a personal gift for yourself. So consider using those. And um, I'm going to go through now some yoga stretching, and then at the end I'm going to share how you can get the oils. Feel free to put any questions in the comments box. I'll get to those at the end. And then um, I also have a form that you can fill out, medical personal interest form, if you want to connect with me personally. And I can offer you a complimentary medical consult along with an oil sample, um, depending on what your personal health needs are. So feel free to reach out. I put all that information in the description box. Okay. Um, let's see. I wanted to just say again, be careful of skin sensitivity. Um, uh, you want to be cautious with children, pregnant if you're nursing, um, which I can help guide you around precautions with that. And then again, with the Arise blend, avoiding sunlight and the UV rays. Um, now they express for at least 12 hours, but I say as long as you're covered, it's safe. You just don't want to be getting out there with the citrus oils directly in the sunlight. So um, let's go ahead and start some yoga stretching. I'm down the road. I want to do some more videos with yoga and maybe even focusing on particular protocols such as back pain, anxiety. Tonight, um, these are going to be some good ones for the jaw, the neck, the shoulders, the hands. So really good now for folks that are because a lot of us are all working on computers, devices, we need to take those stretch breaks every hour when we're working, um, get the blood and chi moving, the energy. So, um, and then also just if you've got tightness and tension, which is, this is a common area um, to get things moving and get them balanced. So I love doing yoga at night. It really helps me to sleep. So let's jump in. We're going to do a jaw one and just know that you can do these seated in a chair. So if you're at your desk and you're taking your stretch break, you can stop, do some uh, yoga stretches that Dr. Michelle showed you or some that you know and get the blood and chi moving. And then I also recommend getting up and walking and moving around a little as well if you're in uh, sitting at your desk all day long. But know that these postures can be done seated in a chair. You can stand, however, I prefer sitting. Um, you can also do these in Indian style and then lotus position, which I'm going to be doing lotus position, and I'm going to show you what that is in case anybody uh, wants to do that. So right now I'm Indian style, as we probably all know being kid, uh, back in the day when we were kids, we sat Indian style. Again, if you can't sit Indian style, sit however it is comfortable for you. Um, and then this is lotus position. So um, let's go ahead and get started. We're going to be doing um, some stretches with the jaw. So we're just going to do a couple. 
And we want to remember to stay breathing in through our nose and out through our mouth. So we're going to open our jaw a couple of times and then close. And then we're going to move it side to side. I've never watched myself do this, so that's, it's except in the mirror, but I usually have my eyes closed. So um, we're going to do side to side and then open and close. You can also do this one laying flat on the mat. I think that's probably why it feels a little odd for me because I'm usually laying flat when I do this one on my yoga mat. So um, again, open and close. And you might hear some pops and clicks. I eat a lot of apples, so I my jaw actually gets overtime <laughs> from chewing on apples so um, it feels really good now we're going to move to doing uh, some neck postures and then let's go ahead and remember to breathe so we're going to inhale chin to the chest or as far as it'll go comfortable and then exhale coming back looking up to the sky inhale exhale Now I usually do four of each of these. Now we're going to do ear to the shoulder, just where it's comfortable. Don't overstretch. <clears throat> and we're going to inhale. And then blow it out. All the while I'm breathing in my, I'm pretty sure I put a line or anchor on. I put anchor on in my diffuser. And I also put it topically on. So you're going to feel this stretch all through the side of your neck. You feel really good. Now we're going to take it into rotation. So when we go down, we exhale and we're going to inhale coming up. Then we're going to go, I'm going counterclockwise. I think I am. <laughs> May not look that way to you. Nice, slow rotations of the neck. Now I just reversed it, so now I'm going clockwise. I like to close my eyes because it helps me to get centered and go within. But you do it however it's comfortable. Okay, great. So now we're going to go to shoulder movements. And then just some basic shoulder rolls going back. And then four going forward. And then I like to do another set of those where I have my hands up on my shoulders. And I'm taking, be careful not to knock anything over here. And remember to breathe, inhale, exhale. And then let's take it forward. Might hear some pop. Okay. And then now we're going to do a really great one for people that have joint pain in the hands, you use your hands a lot. So we're going to stick our arms out, try to keep your shoulders down, rolled back, and we're going to squeeze our thumbs in the palm of our hand. So 
we're going to do that for about a breath of five. And then we're going to release our hands, turn them over, stretch out all your fingers. And then now we're going to intentionally stretch out the thumbs, stretch out the index finger, the middle finger, the ring finger, and the little finger. And then we're going to shake out our hands. And then usually when I'm done doing that, when I sit in posture, I take a few nice inhalation exhalations and I notice the energy that's flowing through my neck, shoulders, all the way to my hands. You might feel a warming energy. Whew, that felt good. Okay, so I hope you all enjoyed that. Um, I'm wishing you many blessings. Um, ways to get your oils, I um, would recommend getting them wholesale um, because you'll save 25%. You can reach out and get them retail from me if you want, but the best way to save is kind of like uh, becoming a Costco member or Sam's Club member, um, and you can do that. I put a couple of um, ways to do that in my description. Um, you can mix and match, pick out your own oils, and then you just pay your membership fee of $35 for the year. And then if you want to save more and you prefer getting like a small kit or a large kit, um, then you'll get even more of a reduced price. So, and then every year, if you want to renew, if you've made the essential oils a lifestyle, um, you want to renew, it's going to be $25, and then they gift you um, a full bottle of peppermint every year. So it ends up being like a $4 fee that you pay for your renewal fee. So um, reach out to me. I can guide you as to what the best oils are for you and your particular health concerns. And then follow me on social media. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more educational videos on Chinese medicine, essential oils, and some fun series that I have. And um, feel free to fill out the uh, medical personal interest form and I'll get back to you. And I'm wishing you many blessings. Namaste. Peace be with you. Ciao.